Hey everybody, Notorious here. Welcome back to my channel. In this episode, I'm going to test and demonstrate one of my latest friction hitches that I created. Here you can see the hitch. This is called the Synergy Hitch, and it is my version of the Stitched Hitch. You can see that just like the Stitched Hitch in the back of the ring, it has an elbow, sometimes called a twist. And that is a crucial component in allowing this hitch to function on a single rope, SRS or SRT, whatever you want to call it, without needing a rope wrench. All right. And you can see that it is different looking than the stitched hitch in the sense that I've added this loop around the anchor ring and that helps to distribute the load of a climber more evenly around the ring. And it also looks much cooler in my opinion. As you can see, I chose to connect this to a hitch climber pulley this is made by a company called DMM. They make excellent hardware, probably my favorite manufacturer of hardware on the planet. And it has three attachment slots. And if you really wanted to, you could use uh, one of these or both of these if you um, were to climb the way it is or the way I have it here. Or you could take these legs and tie poachers loops at the ends of each one. And that would create eyes that you could use just like a regular eye to eye with sewn eyes or spliced eyes, but you just use a knot instead and you can put each loop on either side of this hitch climber pulley and have total access to both holes. But the way I have it here is I have both legs coming down and then I've tied a sheet bend right here to securely connect them. And you can also use other bends such as the hunter's bend. That's a pretty good choice. But then I've taken the loop and using, excuse me, I've used the, um, loop to create eyes by folding it over itself and forming a girth hitch. Okay. And the girth hitch is going to allow me to connect this to a pulley and the pulley is for slack tending. And also if you were to be rope walking up your line into the canopy, you could connect your chest ascender or your, um, what do you call it? Neck tether. I use a neck tether with an accessory carabiner to this pole here, just like you would with a rope wrench setup. All right. So how about we get to the testing? All right. Now let's climb on the synergy hitch and see if it binds when I try to descend. I'm guessing it won't because it's designed not to. Just to be safe, in the rare chance that it does happen to bind, I don't want to get stuck up there, right? So I'll be climbing with a second device. This is a Rope Runner Pro on a second canopy anchor. All right? So that's why I have it there. Okay, I'm gonna put my foot ascender on the rope. And I've got it with a throw weight at the bottom so that way I can effortlessly raise my foot up and have it glide up the rope. Okay, so. 
I'm going to be using the sit and stand method. Ow! Shit. That's why we wear a helmet. All right. Now I'm going to take my foot ascender off. And a normal hitch, if you descend on it, it will get really tight and jam in place on the rope. And like I just mentioned a few minutes ago, people who are unprepared for that can get stuck on their rope and sometimes have to cut something. That's why I've got this as a backup and this hitch works without a rope wrench. Trust me, it works and I'm about to demonstrate it. This hitch will go all the way down with me to the ground without binding or jamming. Watch this. It's gonna lightly depress the top. It doesn't take a lot of effort. And look, I'm going to the ground and if I let go, it'll stop. All right. Let's try that one more time. All right. Take my foot ascender off. And here we go. Same thing. It's not going to jam. <laughs> Look at that. <clears throat> this hitch is great. I can't recommend it enough. Um, obviously, I was inspired by a guy who goes by Brocky on the Tree Buzz and Treehouse forums. He's the guy who created the stitch hitch. He's a friend of mine and extremely intelligent. I've learned so much from him. Um, probably half of what I know about friction hitches I was taught by him. And this is my version of his stitch hitch. Again, this is the synergy hitch. If you're interested in tying this hitch, I will add a link in the description showing you how um, with both a long form and a short form video that I made for this friction hitch. All right, thanks so much for watching. I hope I've convinced you that this is an excellent hitch for SRS without a rope wrench. And if you wanna use it with a rope wrench, it'll work really well too. So please check it out. If you give it a try and have some experiences with it, please share your experiences in the comments section. I would really appreciate it. Please make sure to check sure, uh, please make sure to check out my channel for more hitch how-tos, knot tutorials, and climbing videos. Bye.